Today, I'm going to be talking about Richard Cunningham. He was a serial killer from the 70s, and one of his victims lived in an apartment that he lived in, and he ended up killing her, and they found her at a motel in the parking lot. And most of the times he would take prostitutes and he would beat them and normally he would cut their body parts. He would cut them up. And there was one time he took two, two girls and he killed both of them and he set them on fire after he took some other body parts. He would do this a lot. He would normally always take prostitutes because I guess he felt that it was easier for him than trying to get somebody to go with him that, you know, so after years of killing these poor women, he finally got caught. And one of the victims, her daughter is talking to him and they become friends and she's trying to get him to confess to where exactly he put the woman's remains. It's a really sad story and I think what makes it more sad is that normally prostitutes end up, the police don't really care. It's kind of like when someone is a drug addict they don't care so it's just really sad compared to if it was somebody who was just not into those things they would care more and I just think that's really sad but till next time God bless